serving the people of San Leandro has been a great honor to me. My wife and I chose San Leandro to raise our family over 35 years ago. We raised three children here and take great pride in being active parents, grandparents, and citizens. Our city has given a lot to my family over the 35 years. We have participated in recreation programs like Little Trees and Big Trees. Young Sun used to be known as Dirt Man and Little Trees. The kids play um, soccer and baseball and basketball. We joined the reading programs and had family fun in the parks. I want that to continue for all of our families, all of our children's families. And I also want to conclude projects that I have helped to start. I was raised with the value that you try to give back and you work for the greater good. That's why I ran and that's why I want to continue my work on the council. Preserving San Leandro's wonderful quality of life is important to all of us. Despite the economic downturn, I fought on the council to save child care programs and branch libraries, fought to keep San Leandro Hospital open, and that's why the nurses are endorsing me, and fought to move forward on constructing affordable housing for seniors. Working together, we have already reduced city pension costs by $2.8 million. Actually, I'm glad my opponent agrees with me on pension reform. It, it definitely will happen this year. We're in the negotiating process right now. Um, we produced a balanced budget with an 18% reserve. That's almost unheard of for other cities, 18% reserve. We opened a new senior center that our seniors and community loves. We brought in Kaiser to San Leandro, which means jobs and more jobs. We secured safe routes to school funding for our children. We saved money by making the city more energy efficient. I would also like to partner with other private companies, particularly solar, to bring more energy savings to our city. We can make money by saving money. Still more work to be done. I will continue to take the lead in making public safety a priority and keeping our neighborhood safe. That's why I've been endorsed by police and fire. Bringing new businesses to our city, partnering with our schools for educational excellence, taking care of our seniors, and continuing on the path to fiscal stability. Thank you very much for coming here to listen to us tonight and caring for the city that I know all of us love. I was born and raised in the Philippines a poor and hard-working family. We spoke Tagalog at home. English was our second language. My father was a carpenter, and while he's working hard, my mother took care of eight children. I worked with my father performing manual labor while I attended school. He and my mother understood the value of education. They promised to send us to college, and my brothers and sisters completed our college education. I came to America in 1989. One year later, I began my career in property management of affordable housing for low-income seniors and low-income working families. I have found this to be a rewarding career, and it has given me the opportunity to work with and learn from culturally diverse communities. My wife, Maria, and I, we raised two children, Mia and Matthew, who graduated from San Leandro High School and both are in college now. American San Leandro have given so much to me provided such wonderful opportunities for my children. I wanted to give back to our community. I have been an active member of my church and San Leandro Lions Club. Four years ago, I sought an elective office and won. Today, I serve as the Vice President of San Leandro School Board. It has been a challenging four years due to the state fiscal crisis and cuts forced on school districts. However, I made hard choices necessary to balance the budget while preserving the student programs. 
I insisted upon accountability at all levels of the school district, including the superintendent's office. I collaborated with my fellow trustees in overseeing the construction of the ninth grade campus and arts education center at the budget and on time. I supported the major and school band that will renovate the rural field and all school athletic fields. Today, I wish to continue my public service to the people of San Leandro as your next council member for District 6, running for city council to bring real reform to San Leandro. Business as usual must end at City Hall. Specifically, we must depose the city's financial time down before it explodes. Thank you.